there's a lot going on outside apparently. So let's just let's let's just wait. Uh. Pink paper doll. Hi loves, it's me, your girl Z, and welcome to my channel. All of my social media will be linked in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course, don't be shy, subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified every time I upload. Hey loves, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new, you know what to do. Go ahead and click the subscribe button below and become part of the family. My name is Z, and I love to do tons of lifestyle, beauty, and fragrance related content. So if that's something you guys are interested in, you're definitely going to want to hit the bell notification to be notified every time I post a vid. All of my social media will be linked in the description below. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this haul. Okay, I think that it is no secret by now that fall is my favorite, favorite, favorite season of the year. It's my absolute favorite. I'm obsessed with it. I think I love it even more than Christmas and winter. With that said, I am obsessed with pumpkins. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, then you know that I have a problem and I need some help because I cannot stop buying pink fall decor and particularly pink pumpkins. I did a huge haul. This is my part two from my part one video. I'll be sure to leave a card up on the screen for you guys so you can check out my part one video. Part two, I think I pretty much got the last little bit of things I need and anything else I get from here on out will just be something really small. Anyways, you guys, there's a lot to show you so I'm just gonna go ahead and dig right in. This stuff is gonna be all out of order because this is an accumulation of a couple of days of shopping put together into one and so it's kind of separated by trip and not necessarily by store and it's just too many things to go through so I'm just gonna tell you where they're from as I pull them out of the bag from TJ Maxx I picked up this little um, photo I don't know what you call this like it's like a little plaque and it just says leaves are falling autumn is calling and it's white and it has this like metallic um, frame I don't know what this is but it's like metallic material around it it's like a little copper material and I thought that this would be really cute in the kitchen um, preferably somewhere near the coffee bar I do plan on making a coffee bar in the kitchen that's gonna be like the statement piece I already have the area where I want to make it at I just have to pick up the rest of the pieces but I thought that this would be really cute next to it like to the coffee pot and this was only $5.99 from TJ Maxx this is random but I also picked up a pizza cutter because we had a pizza the other night we made and we didn't have a cutter so I just picked that up I got this a basket this is just for storage and I also thought that I could put like pink pumpkins in here and set it somewhere. I am obsessed with the idea of creating pumpkin patches in a room as like a centerpiece. So in my office, I found a corner that I wanna create a pumpkin patch out of, maybe stick some gnomes in there, some leaves, who knows. And I also wanna do that in the bedroom as well. So I thought maybe getting a basket that you could fill with some pumpkins would look really cute for a pumpkin patch. You could also make like DIY sign to go on the front that says pumpkin patch on it and that would just be super cute this was $2.99 I do already have two of these for storage in my dressing room so if this doesn't end up working for the pumpkin patch I can definitely use this for my dressing room storage oh and my nails I didn't even show you guys my nails editing Zuri put this in look at my nails you guys so cute Aliexpress is the clutch then I was also looking like I said for some bins or crates or baskets that I could use I went to the dollar store and I also went to Goodwill and I didn't find any cute baskets that I absolutely liked or loved so I did find this though at TJ Maxx this was $7.99 and it's just this white crate they had these in tons of different sizes and I went ahead and got the smallest one I could find I do feel like it is kind of borderline big but for the pumpkins that I could put in here I think that it'll fit perfectly and I could put like a little sign here that says pumpkin patch so I'm obsessed with this idea I will definitely show you guys what I end up doing with this in my decorate with me video this is from Marshall's 
This is so pretty, you guys. Yes, another pink pumpkin because I'm obsessed and I cannot stop myself. And I've been begging for help. Like, I really need some type of therapy pink pumpkin rehab. Please help me. This was $9.99 and I just thought it was so pretty. I hadn't seen anything like this. Pink velvet. Um, it also has a gold glitter stem with this gold detailing lace all over it. You guys, I'm just obsessed with it for $10. I thought that that was a really good deal. It is very heavy. And guess what, you guys? It's by my favorite brand, Cashmere and Cupcakes. They just have been killing the fall game this year. I don't know what it is, but everything that this line has created so far, in my opinion, that I've seen, I've been obsessed with. So absolutely love this can't wait to put this somewhere I don't even know where let's just put it here for now because I just want it by me I was looking for boss or bowl filler or some type of filler like small pumpkins and leaf filler and I had found these pumpkins at Marshall's these are just by the brand it just says autumn pumpkin but it broke I guess the associate must have just threw them in the bag the bag was breaking there I think 12 in here oh yeah so there's 12 pumpkins in here they had white ones of these and then they also had these pink ones and this was the only one that they had that was pink i was so shocked to see the pink one but they had white and they did have orange as well i believe but it's just these wooden i'll just pull one out since it's open like wooden pink pumpkins like dust it with pink paint so cute i just thought that was so like shabby chic kind of modern-esque without being too cutesy cutesy i don't know i just obsessed with it those were really super cute and they make awesome base fillers i also have this apothecary jar in my dressing room that's full of full of scrunchies and i'm thinking of taking the scrunchies out and maybe put them in, putting them in a storage bin for the fall and filling that uh, apothecary jar with those pumpkins so i think that will look really really cute i actually have been looking for hand towels and I've seen so many fall and Halloween hand towels but as I mentioned in my last video I'm not a huge Halloween fan I'm more of a fall fan although I'm not gonna lie to you guys Halloween has been getting real cute this year this year has been making me kind of like Halloween a little bit more but I've been looking for hand towels for the kitchen and I found these cute ones this is by the brand my little pumpkin and I think that's the brand that's the brand that's on there this is $6.99 and look at these towels you guys remember I told you that in the kitchen we're going for a coffee bar type of a theme warm cozy leaves pumpkins cinnamon spice and everything nice yes that's the theme for the kitchen so cute they have like these really cute little um i don't know is this hot chocolate it could be hot chocolate or coffee i can't tell it has whipped cream on it but whatever you prefer it's so cute and it'll work perfectly with the colors in the kitchen because our kitchen is already white and copper um slash rose gold and i want to do oranges and reds and browns and yellows a lot of more yellows i'm just into the golden yellows this year so pick this up okay okay you guys so let's talk about it you know how i just said like i have not been into the halloween halloween is just not my thing like i love dressing up for it but it's just never been one of those holidays where i was like really really into it um i just scary things aren't cute to me um and I've never, I've always had a really hard time finding Halloween decor that matched my type of a style. I'm very, very glam and girly and I couldn't really find anything in that. But this year, you guys, I have been seeing some cute pink items. I saw a pink skull with glitter coming down the eye. Um, I saw a pink gnome um, and I thought to get her and then she was gone the next day. But I saw this and I just couldn't resist. This is the See No Evil, Hear No Evil, Speak No Evil Skeletons. You guys have probably seen this all over, like Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, because the skeletons are going crazy this year. And I found this in pink, you guys. I'm not entirely sure where this is gonna go. I'm thinking I could probably transform my office like lean more towards Halloween in the office and just keep the bedroom fall 
yeah I'm thinking that's what I could do um, but I just love this piece I had to pick it up it was ten dollars it was just like calling my name there was girls around it staring at it looking at it and they were just kind of like mm. It's just not spooky enough. And I'm just like, it's freaking spooky to me. And it's cute. So I picked it up. I love it. I will definitely show you guys what I do with this because I'm not entirely sure yet. But I'm excited to experiment with that. Just get your popcorn, people. Get your snacks. Get your whole meal, okay? Because you're going to be here a while because I have a lot of stuff. I went to Home Goods and I went in there looking for... If you guys saw in my last video, I showed you this gray white pumpkin candle and I was just obsessed with it it smelled so good I finally did end up getting the lid open um, but I wanted to go back because I thought maybe I might be able to find a white one that I could put on my desk by the way you guys my desk is arriving finally after several moments my desk is arriving tomorrow Monday between 1 and 3 and I will be finishing up my office decorate roofing video and office tour to follow that. But anyways, not to get off topic, I was looking for that candle that I could put on my desk. And as I was looking for it, I really couldn't find any. Like it's from Martha Stewart and that was the only one that I could find. So I started Googling and looking online and looking at Poshmark and I found that it comes in a black and pink i'm like what gray black pink and white yes honey so i went to home goods to look for that candle and i did not find that candle but i did find two candles by martha stewart from that same fall line these are the ones that i found i found three of them they also have like this pearl finish to them whereas the gray one didn't have a pearl finish it was just a regular glossy finish it has this gold stem absolutely love it and it's a three wick you guys it smells so freaking good i don't know why normally i'm not into like the white pumpkin scent but for some reason this year i am obsessed with the white pumpkin scent it just smells creamy i don't even know how to describe it it just doesn't smell like a harsh pumpkin and cinnamon it's like a creamy pumpkin and thyme oh, and nutmeg it's so good but anyway this was 12.99 i did end up picking up two out of the three and then i like hit myself later for not picking up the third one because then I started thinking and I'm like oh I should put these in the bedroom on the nightstands one over here one over there and then I'm like damn it now I don't have one for my desk so now we're on the hunt for a small pumpkin candle that I can put on my desk because I've decided to now use these in the bedroom but they're cute and they're only $12 so I had to pick those up you guys and they are by Martha Stewart brand if I did not say so this is by the Red Leaf Home brand and it's in white pumpkin and like I told you guys I hardly ever see any fall decor or fall candles in the pump in the pink packaging so when I saw this I had to pick it up this was only $6.99 you guys and I it smells different from the Martha Stewart though. This one smells a little bit more pumpkin-y. It kind of smells like oatmeal and cinnamon. Yeah. But it smells good nonetheless and I thought this would be great to set in my dressing room area and give that spicy fall pumpkin scent to my dressing room. So we picked that up for $7. That's a good deal considering how much Bath & Body Works candles cost and you guys know that's where I get all my candles. <laughs> Well, most of my candles. Okay, guys, sorry if this video seems super rushed, but like I said, I have a lot of stuff to show you and I do not want to run out of space on my camera. I like everything to be inside of one clip and I hate moving multiple clips around when I'm editing, so y'all just gonna get me on a, on a speed roll. Okay, guys, I was just going crazy when I saw this. This is by Cupcake and Cashmere, another yes, pink pumpkin but not just any pink pumpkin it has a pearl finish and it's also a pink gradient into white like a ombre you guys I don't know if you can see that because of the lighting and the way it's bouncing off of the um, pearl finish but I had to pick this up you guys by my favorite brand 
cupcakes and cashmere and this was $7.99 I thought that was a really good deal $7.99 for a pumpkin this big not sure where I will put this but you guys know the the options are endless <laughs> it's endless and then to go along with that I also picked this one up but I picked it up on a different day this is kind of like a taller pumpkin you guys let me know the names of these type of pumpkins in the description below i think they have to be named different right like is this a squash no this is not a squash sorry i know what a squash is this is a pumpkin but what what type of pumpkin is this let me know in the comments below this was also 7.99 and they match you guys i'm going to stick them together somewhere they're gonna look super cute and i cannot wait i am just gonna lose my freaking to pink pumpkins you guys I can't stop okay and then I saw these pink pumpkins at home goods and I had to pick these up as well I do have I think I purchased two pumpkins like this last year if I'm not mistaken I have to go back and see what I have in my inventory but I wasn't entirely sure so I told myself you better get it while you're here so I picked these two pumpkins up they are a like uh, not velvet they're like a velour type I will call it like a velour type uh, material I don't know but it's $9.99 and again buy my favorite brand cupcakes and cashmere with the gold stem I am thinking these will probably end up somewhere in the bedroom because the bedroom is predominantly pink and gold and then next from home goods I picked up this mug it says I woke up like this and it's pink it's already done need I say more it was $5.99 I saw this in the checkout and I always pick up something in the checkout line so I don't know I just thought it was very fitting and I thought it would be really cute to put like a pumpkin on top of it like a little mini pumpkin on top of it and set it on my desk that's gonna be adorable actually I also got this from this pumpkin from home goods it's like this cracked not even cracked it's just like this pretty glass effect it's like a cloudy pink glass at the bottom that like kind of goes off into this clear glass with glitter at the top you guys I'm doing my best to describe this for you it's just so cute and it's made of glass and it's really pretty and unique so I ended up picking it up Lord knows I do not need any more pink pumpkins but I just keep going also from home goods I had seen these pumpkins and I was looking for them in white I've seen them in every other color but white but then then I saw this in this pink blush it's like I can't tell is it pink or peach it's like borderline pink is it it's like blush but it could be peach it's like peach but it could be blush and I don't know if I'm gonna keep these or not but they're covered in like this um, velvety material and so I thought this could also be a filler this was a $9.99 you guys they have these at home goods in tons of different colors and style I did find this set of two kitchen towels at Ross and it's in this like mustard color golden yellow I thought it was perfect and I just fell in love with the sayings on it it's so simple but at the same time super cute it says hello fall on one side and then you flip it over and it says sweater weather on the other side I thought this was super cute and I thought I could actually pair it with these towels we'll see what they look like actually right now yeah that's gonna look so cute so we have one printed towel and then we'll have like these um, colored towels next to them it's gonna be so cute and this was only $4.99 you guys and I like this one because it's a towel that I can actually wipe my hands with you guys know the towels that they have out right now are not towels you can actually wipe your hands with they're just like decor towels but these you can actually use to wipe your hands so obsessed with that so then we went into Michaels and I just wanted to see what they had for fall really I was really on a hunt for a pink leafy garland and a wreath um, I was not able to find my wreath but I did find the leafy garland here is the pink leafy garland that I found you guys it's so cute isn't it I thought I could hang this inside of my dressing room over the mirror of the sink I thought that might look cute or even over my closet or my door not entirely sure which where it's gonna go but I'm thinking those are the three spots that have the option of it going there this is by the brand Ashland and this is six feet long and it was 
$19.99, but I got it on sale for $15. I do think that's kind of expensive for a garland like this. Um, I just don't feel like it's that special to spend $20, even $15 on. But because I looked everywhere, you guys, I searched Amazon, I searched everywhere for pink leafy garlands, and I could not find it anywhere. So I went ahead and decided I just had to go ahead and get this. I think it's so cute. And I cannot wait to play around with it. And then also from the same Ashland brand, I picked up these little flower bouquets. They had these flowers on sale for 99 cents and they had yellows. They had all of the fall colors. So they had like a burgundy red, they had orange, they had yellow, all of those type of colors. They had black even. I went ahead and just picked up the cream colored ones so I feel like you could use these for fall, but they could also transition into winter or spring as well um, because of the color choice and I actually want to go back and get some yellow ones that look like these and I also saw these candles and I just could not help myself and these were originally $7.99 this is just ridiculous if you ask me like $7.99 for this like $8 are you kidding me anyways it's just these many many it's just these mini pumpkins they're like in the cream color same color that matches these flowers and I have this wooden shelf in my hallway that's Pinky playing with the lid. You guys hear by the door. <laughs> I have this little wooden shelf in my hallway so I wanted to kind of make that kind of fall and just add in pops of fall things but I didn't want to take away from the vibe that's already in that entryway and it's kind of like a bohemian free spirited type of space it's cream tans neutrals with little hints of pink so I thought that this would work perfect in there and there's three so I cannot wait I also love like the tie on this it's just the whole aesthetic probably shouldn't have spent that much money on it but I believe that these were 40% off so they probably came out to around five six dollars so now we're moving into Hobby Lobby and you guys know I can go in here and go crazy but I didn't. I was like, I need to stay calm. I need to stay focused. I need to have a plan for what I want to do in my home. And then I can choose pieces that cater to that plan instead of just seeing all of these wonderful ideas because it's the mecca for ideas. But what that does to you if you don't know what you want to do is it kind of confuses you and you end up getting a lot of stuff that are just match, mitch matchy or does it work within your space because you didn't have a plan. So I tried to stick to my plan. I knew that I wanted to focus on things from the coffee bar. So I did find this little sign. It says pumpkin spice coffee bar, enjoy. And I thought it was super cute. Um, the only thing that I will say about this sign is low key from far back it does look like a football and I don't know why to me when I look at it it looks like a football sign um, so if I find something cuter I'm hoping that the Dollar Tree will come out with more cuter stuff I noticed that the 99 cent store duh, is coming out with cute fall stuff so I'm hoping that they'll come out with some cute fall um, coffee bar signs that I can create with but for now I thought this would be okay it was 40% off all of their fall stuff was 40% off you guys this was originally $5.99 with 40% off and I think it's cute for the time being how could it be fall without pine cones so I picked up this bag of mini pine cones and there are 24 pieces inside and it was $4.99 with 40% off. So I thought that was a really good deal. This is really great to have because you could always spray paint them any color that you want to go with for your home decor. You can add glitter to them. You can even use them for a garland, whatever you like. This is just always great to have on hand, especially if you're a crafty DIY type of person. So of course I had to get some. And then lastly from Hobby Lobby, I picked up these pink plush pumpkins. Oh my God, you guys, I know, I told you, stop me, handcuff me, lock me away because I cannot stop. I saw these and I was just like, oh my God. There was three on the shelf. I grabbed three. One of them was like the uh, material was ripped. So I put her back and I'm like, dang it, I only have two of these things. So I went around the whole store. I don't know why Hobby Lobby does this, you guys, but they'll have different like setups or in towers or whatever you want to call them. And they'll like, instead of having one product on the shelf like stacked, they'll have it all around the store. So I literally had to go all around Hobby Lobby searching for these, but I was able to get 
six of them and it's just so cute it's like a plushy pink material and I love it it's the stem is brown and kind of ugly but you can spray paint this or put some Mod Podge on it and put glitter on top of it and it'll look super cute I mean that's what I'm planning to do with it you guys will definitely see that in my decorate with me video these were originally $7.99 a piece and they were 40% off each so do the math there I plan on using this box hopefully they'll fit a little cute pink pumpkin patch and then say pumpkin patch there and stick it in the corner of a room you can add some fairy lights to this some leaves inside some pine cones around and it will just be a wonderful beautiful centerpiece so I'm super excited about that hey okay, guys I had to let pinky in because she was at the door and she sticks her paw underneath the door and it's so cute um, but I just melt and I can't leave her out there um, So I did look down in the bin and I was able to find some more things from Marshall's So I'm going to show you guys those right now. I got this from Marshall's this is by the cupcake and cashmere brand and this was $6.99 and again, it's this tall white pearl finish pumpkin I just thought it was super unique and like it could really be used anywhere in the house I don't know I just thought it was super pretty and super unique and I thought it would look nice also on a shelf something this tall or even by the fireplace so I got this pumpkin knitted garland like how could you not you guys I was looking for a gray garland to go in the living room by the fireplace and I was not able to find that I was able to find that like black and white plaid I forget what you call it buffalo plaid print that everyone's into and then some of it had like gray leaves but it just wasn't the vibe I was going for and I just saw these and I was just like oh my god I can't they're super super cute I have to do it so I don't know if these will go in the living room because our living room is gray white and silver but these might look cute um, in the kitchen above maybe I can put it with like the leafy garland above the big window Ooh. okay guys you guys will see what I end up doing with this in my decorate with me video but this was $12.99 and like I said you guys they had this in like tons of different prints tons of different colors just not what I was looking for which was the gray one but this is so cute you guys I'm obsessed with it I also got a rug and I will insert some footage here of the rug but it is this orange trick-or-treat rug with like black letters to say trick-or-treat in sparkle and I saw it and I just had to get it I actually got it from Marshall's and I forgot to show you guys that it's actually I got two rugs I also got a rug from Michael's but both of them are in the car so I'll have to insert a clip of them up on the screen and then the other one that I got is a pumpkin one that says hello pumpkin and I just thought that that was super cute and sweet so I wasn't planning on getting two mats for outside of the door um, because I just felt like I didn't need to but those mats were just so cute so I couldn't resist and I had to pick them up and also what really um, made me decide to get the mat was this item right here that I saw at Home Goods. it is this I know you guys I told you guys I'm not into Halloween but it's just been getting cuter and cuter and cuter this year and this was $14.99 you guys this is a wreath but look at it look at how cute it is it's a black kitty and he has a fluffy tail and whiskers and a nose with his orange bow he's so cute for $15 you guys can't see it on camera but he's sparkly he's so sparkly and cute I love him for $15 he just made my day and then after I got him I was like oh crap he's not gonna match my pumpkin rug so now what I'm going to do, and then I was like, wait a second, I could decorate the outside for Halloween and for fall. So I was like, all I need is a reef and a um, mat. So I was like, I'll just get a matching mat. So that's why I got the trick or treat mat. I feel like it matches better with the uh, black kitten. Now we're going to get into what I picked up from the 99 cent store and the Dollar Tree, you guys. I know not everybody has 99 cent stores in their area. I live in California where we have 99 cent stores. And how it works is not everything in the store is 99 cents, but the majority of the things in the store is 99 cents. And if it's not 99 cents, it's 
drastically discounted to wherever else you would go to get the item. Anyways, went to the 99 cent store and I was looking for um, some leafy garland. Hi, mommy. Hi, Pupu. You want to say hi? She said no. <laughs> I got this yellow leafy garland, super cute, right? I thought that I could add like pumpkins to this, even acorns to this, dress it up, make them a little bit fuller, twist them with other different color um, leafy garlands to create a nice garland that I can put over the uh, window in the kitchen and over the mirror in the guest bathroom because I decided that I am going to decorate the guest bathroom. Um, this was $1.49, so $1.49, you cannot beat that. And I believe this is six feet. Yes, this is also six feet. So I thought that was really nice. I got this one. This is an orange one. And then I got two of those, I think, two orange ones. Sorry guys, it's a little messy. I got two of the orange ones, one yellow, and then I think I got a red one. Yeah. And then I got this red one. So I think all of these colors together just scream fall and are gonna look super cute together. I got this sign that says, hello fall, it's so cute. It's just this wooden board sign and it has glitter on the letters for fall. I thought this was cute. I thought this would look really nice in the kitchen too, like in the window. So I picked that up. And then I got a bunch of pumpkins for the bathroom. I have these little white shelves on the guest bathroom wall and I wanna replace some of the like spring, like I have these little spring birds with flowers coming out of them. I wanna replace that with something fall. So I found these blue mini pumpkins and I thought this would be cute to put on that shelf and replace those. These were 99 cents and they're like crackled gold glitter on them perfect for our bathroom because our bathroom at the moment is blue and white so I thought that that would go really nicely with that I just got more and more things there is a little basket on the back of the toilet seat that currently holds like some old toothpaste and a lip balm I'm gonna take that stuff out I'm gonna store it underneath the cabinet and then I thought I could use that basket to fill with pumpkins and make it like a little cute pumpkin patch or a little cute uh, centerpiece slash display whatever you want to call it so I did see these these were 99 cents a piece and they're just like these cute blue velvet pumpkins now the blue in my bathroom is a navy blue and this is more of like a teal blue you guys can see that but it's so close you really Really can't tell unless you were just like that anal um, but they're so pretty I got one two four of those and hopefully that'll be enough the basket is relatively small so I think it'll be enough if not too much I picked up these two velvet pumpkins these were 99 cents as well they're just this like like golden color I just thought these were a really natural color and that they could fit really anywhere in the house as like a filler. I do have this rose gold basket, napkin holder type thing situation. I'll show you guys in the kitchen. Um, and I thought I could, you might use that basket to fill it with pumpkins and that might be cute. But you guys will see what we decide to do in the decorate with me video. But I thought, why not have these? They can go somewhere. They match the color of fall. Um, you can't have too many pumpkins, right? <laughs> I picked up two of these sweater weather type pumpkins. I call it sweater weather. It has like the sweater material all across it. These were actually $1.99. They were a little bit more than the other ones. I do not know why. Um, that was really odd to me, but I thought these were super cute and they would work really well in the entryway or really anywhere in the house because they are that neutral color. And the only thing I don't like about these, you guys, is the stem. I'll tell you, the stem just looks so fake and ugly so I might end up dressing up all of these stems we'll see what I end up doing also I picked up this little pumpkin pick I just thought it was super cute and this is white you guys saw me get another pumpkin pick from Hobby Lobby a really big one I think I showed this in my first video and it was like a um, cream color that's gonna go into the hallway but I thought that this is also nice to get you can always dress up like I said any bouquet or vase that you already have in your home by just adding a little pick like this and it will turn it instantly into a fall masterpiece this was 99 cents and it's just like this little door hanger I guess 
and it says pumpkin patch on it. I have a plan for this. I'm gonna stick this in the basket as the sign hanging out of the basket and it's gonna say pumpkin patch. It's super cute. You guys will see what I decide to do with that, but they have these in many different colors with many different sayings, but this one matched perfectly with the bathroom. I also picked up these two ceramic pumpkins. I picked these up to go inside of, oh my God, those are gorgeous. I just noticed on camera. Um, I picked these up to go inside of the kitchen. As I told you guys at the beginning of this video, the kitchen is white and like rose gold slash copper. So I thought that this would fit perfectly in there, if not on the windowsill by the coffee bar. Then I picked up these fall leaves fillers. There's 22 pieces inside and I thought that this would be great again to fill a vase or a pumpkin patch or just sprinkle them around on a desk or something like that or a table to make it look and seem more fall. I don't know but I just got them. I think they'll be cute. They also have glitter on them you guys. I love the way they're dyed because they really do look real but they have gold glitter on them which is really nice. Then next I got this fall leafy bouquet in this golden yellow color because these are the colors that are going to be going in the guest bathroom and I wanted to give the guest bathroom a little bouquet like a fall bouquet so I thought this might be cute and now that I'm thinking about it this could probably go in there oh you guys look at that like something a situation like that that's gonna be really nice and I got you guys this pumpkin this was a 99 cents this is a little bit more like the blue that I actually have in my bathroom it's a really dark blue you guys can see how it's a little bit different but it's not too far off I got this to go maybe on the sink um, next to the vase that I'm gonna be putting up and I actually like the stem on this one because it has a little bit of a gold um, paint on it to just make it look a little bit better than that regular plastic gold stem again it's cracked with like gold glitter and it's just so pretty and beautiful and I thought it would be perfect in that guest bathroom and then I picked up a vase for the bouquet that I want to create in the bathroom and it's just this frosted blue vase they had this in like a lime green color a golden yellow color a orange color and a red they only have one blue can you believe that I picked up the blue one and it's so cute it has like this tweed um, bow right here and a leaf pendant and I just thought that was so cute so I thought this would go really nicely and it's slim enough where you can set it on the sink that's gonna look so cute you guys I'm so freaking excited about this again this is only 99 cent and the best thing about these type of vases is that you can remove this little bow tie and pendant after the holidays and this can transition into a spring vase it can even transition into a winter vase if you're gonna be decorating your bathroom like I'll probably decorate my bathroom like winter wonderland theme since it's already blue and white anyway so it'll be really nice to use this for that as well and just at some winter holiday Christmassy bouquet last but not least is my fall wreath that rhymed this was $4.99 as I told you guys everything at the 99 cent store is not 99 cents some of it is a little bit more but still five dollars for something like this I think is really really nice I have been looking for tons and tons of wreaths I searched Hobby Lobby I searched Target I searched home goods and most of the wreaths I couldn't really find a wreath that was decent that was under 20 bucks except for this one I think it's really cute because it's actually shaped like a pumpkin it's kind of small I feel like I'll be able to look out my peepo and see who's at my door even though I have a wreath on it and look at it it has these cute pumpkins leaves it has like little what is this wheat it has an acorn and it also has a pine cone and I just thought this is super cute I will be DIYing this a little bit and dressing it up you guys know I love to make things my own so I'm definitely gonna be adding like a bow at the top and just make it a little bit more zuri uh, but yeah absolutely love this for five dollars I thought that that was a freaking steal and you guys Oh, we made it we're at the end of the video guys and my camera's about to shut off I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to comment below and let me know which item was your favorite I love you guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and I will see you loves in the next video bye bye guys